It's Jason with Mike, the Escape Room Guys. We're back with another, another episode uh, of Dispatch from Breakout Games. We're up to box number three, which is chapter two. Um, and this one was pretty tough. Yeah, this is the On the Run series, uh, which is their uh, monthly subscription game. Um, we did pretty well with chapters one and two, and it's now a year later since we've completed <laughs> chapter two. Uh, life gets in the way. Um, but we kind of blew through the first two. Uh, we finished both of those, I think, in under, under an hour. Under an hour each, each um, not t uh, together. Chapter three, uh, it took us a couple hours, uh, and then we had to actually go into the Slack um, app and figure out and you know see what people were saying about it because we did get stuck at one point. So yeah, We set aside like six hours one day to finish all five remaining boxes and we got through two of them. So we'll talk about mm -hmm. box four uh, a little bit later. But this one was tough. So um, like we said, on the wrong chapter two is the what's inside card. So we got everything, thankfully. Um, one thing in particular that cost us a lot of time was the uh there's a puzzle using chopsticks and a fan um fan and and chopsticks the wrapper at least not the chopsticks themselves but this one took us probably the, the most amount of time <laughs> uh you're not a little old asian lady so <laughs> but anyway, that, that one took us the most amount of time uh, and it we still we, we still needed, really we needed help uh, from another player with that yeah. one uh, that is one thing that I wish that uh, breakout games would do is figure out a better way to provide hints when you get stuck. Uh, the email didn't help us because we were playing on a holiday. Um, I don't know if it's an automated system, but uh, we really didn't get any help there. Yeah, they got back to us Tuesday afternoon. We played on, on Monday for uh, Memorial Day. Um, and you know, by the time I sent the email, we figured it out like 20 minutes later. Mm -hmm. So by the time they got us back to us, I should say. So if you're stuck. So if you're stuck. Um, the Slack app is your best bet. Uh, other people have played. Uh, there are also Facebook uh, groups that you you can go in and join and ask for questions. I would do that now, just because if you're playing and you get stuck, uh, it does take a little bit of time for your um, request to join the group to be accepted. So if you're in the middle of playing and you get stuck, you're kind of screwed. Um, but we did find out uh, someone from the Slack app did get back to us uh, with where we were stuck on the chopsticks and fan ad. And then once we figured that out, um, the rest of the game went pretty, pretty quickly. Some of the other things that I had read online while we were trying to figure it out was that that's really the puzzle in this box that pushes you forward. So you kind of need to do it first or at least one of the first two. Um, this is in Tokyo, by the way. I don't know if we yeah. mentioned that. You can kind of tell by the box and the paraphernalia inside. But um, yeah, this one was hard. I would say if you've never folded any origami before, um, find someone that has. Uh, or, or watch the video that they provide. Or honestly, just look closely at it and figure it out yourself. It's pretty self-explanatory when he, when he, and I failed miserably. Look at this, this folded mess, jumbled mess of crap now. Um, so there's another part uh, that I will remind you with uh, is these games all are meant to work together. Um, so items that you have in box one and box two really did come into play for box three. Uh, we forgot that after playing a year ago that uh, there were items that we needed. Uh, box two, we found something pretty quickly, but we forgot about the journal in box one. And I didn't forget there. about it. And I just couldn't find anything useful the first three times I looked. So uh, keep your other boxes at the ready, and if you do get stuck, uh, pull, search through the other boxes for things that will help you out. Um, if you haven't by now, start taking notes. Mm -hmm. um, we, we've got a couple pages of notes from the first two games. We didn't take anything for this one because I think we were so frustrated at some point we just said, screw it. Uh -huh. um, and because we still wanted to play at least box four, like I said, you know, we set aside half a day for this and got through two of them. So. Yeah, yeah, we were off our game a little bit. Uh, anyway, uh, there is another one that you that I'll give you a little hint on. It's the memo, um, and those of you who have it will know which one this is. Um, make sure you listen to exactly what they tell you as to the format for what you need to do. Um, just out of uh, muscle habit. memory and habit, yeah. um, we did not, and it took us a little bit to get into it. Um, but everything went from there. Uh, the other part that you'll need to remember is that uh, use your phone, use your devices to look things up. 
don't look up hints, but the, the part of the game is for you to use Google, use other searches, look at maps and things like that and see if that will give you a little hint as to moving forward. Um, Google did help us uh, with one of the final pieces on this. Um, I don't even know what you're talking about. This, you did it. <laughs> I was too frustrated at some point. I was just watching review videos and found nothing useful online either. So we didn't want to give away any spoilers either, but uh, look at everything very carefully um, and make sure you do have all the pieces that use the checklist when you first start using this. And yes, there is something in this box that you do not need to use. So it will carry forward. Just keep that in mind if you realize you didn't use it. You weren't supposed to. And that is by design, apparently. So um, that's about it. Uh, I'll say this one was tough. Uh, it was, and this time it was just the two of us. The last time we played the first two, our friend Mark was with us. Um, but you might need a couple other people to look at these things with a fresh perspective. So uh, that's pretty much it. Uh, we'll go on to box four, chapter three, in a couple minutes. They started with a zero numbering system, so just throwing off our vocal patterns for lack of a better word anyway right. we'll catch you in uh, episode four see ya